put on their headphones like, oh, no, not this again. Dave and Jimmy, today's a special show, and I'll tell you why. We're all a little off. I don't know why that happened. Maybe we had odd food. Maybe we didn't get enough sleep. Maybe some of us are taking prescription drugs that are kind of playing with our mind. <laughs> but we're all a little off. So, Aaron, you walked into, I don't know what's going to happen. Are you on, Aaron? Yeah, Are you okay? I didn't, think, I didn't think I was off. I just got here. No, you're focused, man. You're on your game. Well, good, Super because focused. you're going to be hosting the show here soon because the rest of us <laughs> oh. are all out. <laughs> Can you you want to introduce the next song? It's Little Nas X Panini. You ready to give this a go? I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> what, Kelsey? What? I'm laughing at the room. Okay. The room's funny, yeah, Jimmy. I'm enjoying It's just unusual the today. All of us being just laughing one at us. Beat oh, oh no! my gosh! Dave and Jimmy, now with breaking joke news with the Dave and Jimmy joke news team. Here's anchor man. No, Dame Judy Dench. Here's anchor man Dave. <laughs> here's anchor woman no, I'm not Dame Judy Dench. Judy Dench. I'm not Judy Dench. I thought you wanted to be. You'll know in a minute. <laughs> okay. Okay, fine. Who Whatever are you? you are. I'm Al Roker. Okay. You're Al Roker? <laughs> Al Roker. Well, that's obscure. All right. You're a little heavy today. Go with it. <laughs> All right, ready? Here we go. Nicole Kidman and Keith Urban have pledged half a million dollars to help fight the Australian wildfires. They're worried that if the flames get too close to their home, Nicole's face will start to melt. <laughs> <laughs> Justin Bieber's YouTube docuseries debuts January 27th. Timing is good because we go to war with Iran. We'll need a new prisoner torture technique. <laughs> That's pretty good. Uh, the minimum wage in California went up a dollar on January 1st. Well, now I can afford to get that cool rear spoiler for my 2001 Maxima, said Scott Bale. Oh! <laughs> that was a mouthful. Oh. The average American gains six to eight pounds between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Oh. As I call them, serious underachievers. <laughs> Meatloaf says climate change doesn't exist. Well, I won't change my opinion until I hear from MC Hammer and Brett Michaels. <laughs> Adam Sandler says he's never excited to do romantic scenes. God, I think the women feel. <laughs> well, the songwriter of the song Deo died at age 95. He leaves behind a wife, three kids, and lots of untallied bananas. <laughs> Tallying bananas. Yeah, you gotta know that song. Untallied bananas. <laughs> yep. I love that one. I don't know why. Because we never use that word in common English language anymore. The Trump administration has proposed placing tariffs on French wine, cheese, and handbags. In response, in response, the French angrily twirled their mustaches and furiously adjusted their ties. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Uh, Alanis Morissette is going out on tour with Garbage and Liz Fair, but to afford tickets, you might have to pawn both your discman and your beeper. <laughs> Judy Dench <laughs> turns 85 today. Wow. Most people call her Dame Judy Dench. Unfortunately, others call her Newt Gingrich. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, Vanilla Ice is officially divorced. So if you're in Palm Beach County, Florida, you now have something to talk about if you get him as your Lyft driver. <laughs> nice. Nicholas Cage turns 56 today. He plans to get rip roaring drunk, walk around in public, and scream incoherently. That is going to celebrate his birthday. <laughs> uh, I got more. I just said it. That was a good note. Okay, Al Roker. Good Thank job. You. That's your breaking joke news. <sighs> Earlier in the day, no lie, Aaron. Uh, my wife saw cats last night. Oh. I know. And she cried a bit because there was a cat that reminded her of a cat that had passed on, and it was played by Dame Judy Dench. Then Jimmy immediately, his eyes bugged out, and goes, just 10 seconds ago, I had this waking thought of Dame Judy Dench. Really? The That's most walking obscure, in the studio this morning. The most obscure instant memory. I think her name is so silly. I'm like, I want to work Dame <laughs> Judy Dench into the show somehow. And then Dave brings it up for his break. And then and she then was in my birthday. jokes. I know. Well, it was last week. I kind of oh. fudged it a little bit. Anyway. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah. 
<laughs> Jimmy has been given the gift of prophecy, but only in obscure names <laughs> 10 seconds before we air them. And I can see knowing the when we get food deliveries, you always know that. I usually okay. do, and today yeah. I don't feel it at okay. all. Yeah. You're like the Nostradamus of the least important stuff. <laughs> exactly. This is Dave and Jimmy.